trainers. I hope you guys are having a great day. My name is Hollywood and you probably know me, but you probably don't know my friend right here. This is Moose. He was gonna be our mail trail guide this summer. Unfortunately, we're not having in-person camp, but he's gonna be here to help us explain how to do 550 cord paracord bracelets today. So a fun fact about 550 paracord is that it can hold 550 pounds. Now this doesn't mean you should go rock climbing with it, but it does mean this could be a useful tool for camping. So the first step for a 550 paracord bracelet is to pull both the buckles away from each other and then you're going to place your wrist down in the middle of the bracelet. Then you're going to make sure it's clipped on and you might need a help from a parent or a friend. And once it's clipped on, you're then going to pull it tight, but don't leave it tight. You're going to want to loosen it just a little bit because the paracord bracelet is going to get a little bit thicker. So once you have measured out how big you want your bracelet, you're then going to unbuckle and you're going to make sure that the buckle is facing away from you. Once you've done that, you're then going to take the string in your right hand and you're going to feed it underneath the two middle strings. And then you're going to take that same string and put it over the left string, then feeding it through, then taking the left the left string and then pulling it through the loop and make sure you pull nice and tight. Make sure you pull through the first loop and it might look a little funky, but that's okay. Just keep at it. Then you're going to do the same thing again by taking the left side and pulling it through. And then you're going to take it and put it on top of the right string and then go ahead and feed it through the loop one more time. And a helpful tool for you guys is to think under, over, and through. So we went right on first, then we went left. So now we're gonna go back to the right string. Again, just like Moose said, we're gonna go under the middle strings, over the other side, and through the loop we just made. Under, over, through the loop, and then pull it tight. You guys will get much better at this as you go. The first few stitches are always the hardest, but after you keep at it and you finish your bracelet, it'll start to look something like this. So, once you have finished tying your paracord bracelet, you're going to ask your parent to grab some scissors and a lighter. So what your parent is going to do is they're gonna go ahead and cut the paracord very close to the actual bracelet. Wonderful. And then once you are done cutting your paracord bracelet, you're then going to light the ends with a lighter from your parents. And you don't have to catch it on fire, but just get it hot enough where you can press. And what this is doing is it allows the bracelet to not become undone. And once that is cooled, then you can go ahead and put it on your wrist. <laughs> Guys, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> and you're ready to go. Thanks for watching.